Hey guys, this is Eskimo Poon, and we are back to let's play my time at Porsche on the PC. Last time, uh, well, last time wasn't the best because we got lost in the, the sewers, and I had to leave for work, so we ended up uh, leaving our in-game day a pretty decent episode of length, you know. But we ended up leaving the episode, the episode, uh, the in-game day at like seventeen hundred or something like that. Also, I had a cold, and or. I don't know if I had a fucking cold or not because okay, this is this is technically what I consider to be the same day as that. Uh, so I work night shifts, and for me, I wake up at two in the afternoon, go to bed at like anywhere from six to eight in the morning or so, and until I go to bed, I consider it the same day as from when I woke up. So I just got off work, and surprisingly, I wasn't sniffling at all at fucking work. Like all that runny nose and shit that I had before work, fucking gone by the time I, by the time I drove the 30 minutes to work. So I was just getting fucked when I was trying to record because naturally, naturally. So oh well, good shit. Yeah, today I think we're gonna be getting another diagram from the research center, so that'd be nice. Also, I should probably turn in my... I should probably clean out my inventory at some point here. But I want to see if I can do a couple minor upgrades. If I can. Alright, now that we've got the... Now that we've got the, the bigger platform, we should be good for the most part, I think. Deal plates, meat... Copper pipes. I think we still need more copper pipes, don't we? Yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna tell it to make. I'll tell it to make as many as I need when I check how many I need because I don't know how many I need. Because uh, we need 12 of these damn buckets when I thought we needed six or like two or some shit. Uh, oh, we can make nine. I think. I think six is all we need, so that should be the last of this right here. Yeah, nice. Sweet. We got our water wheel. Well, this thing's fucking huge. Wow, I have no room to put this. And apparently you can't put it outside your little... You can't put it outside your area. Okay. Uh, Higgins might end up getting a slightly better idea than us. Oh, we got the cooking set. Neat. I wonder I wonder if we're going to run out of, like, the the five research disc tier research type stuff. Or if when we get them all, it'll just not have the option to be there. Who wants help? Poison water. Okay, uh, we got to talk to somebody. Um, who are we talking to here? No idea. But, let me go in here first. Higgins, you little ass bastard. One small satchel. Three scarves. Oh, he took it. Why did he take a D rank? Those give, I think, less reputation. 38, 88, and 91. I think I can figure out how to make a small satchel, hopefully. Uh, Hello. Anthony, or Antoine. Nope. I've cut down my water usage by a factor of 10. Yeah, well. Uh, I mean, I technically cleared out the water. I just have to tell somebody about it, so... Actually, if I run over to Higgins' place, can I steal his bar from his furnace? And if I do, will he say anything? bar. Neat. And I don't think he's there to see it. Oh, he's taking his time. I don't even see him over there. <laughs> Alright, now that we can make the cooking set, that's nice. We can uh, make that fish porridge for Dawa. It was like salt, fish, and something. 
Huh. No, I guess it, I guess they just have this sitting here. I, I was hoping to see like the cooking set or something, but I guess not. Hello. Research. Hi. Did you discover something new? Uh, oh, yeah, the five. Okay, so the five data disk option isn't there anymore. I think we might have given her all the. Uh, we might have gotten like all the five disc recipes or whatever. Uh, okay, you know what? Let's just work on the ten data disc right now. Still, if you want to expedite our research, more. The data corruption there on these discs are minimal. Yeah, we can get the discs fast enough to just throw them at her, kinda. So I'm not terribly worried about it. Neat. Alright, uh, we need some... We need some blood rubies or whatever those things are, because we're gonna need those for... some stuff, like feeding the dog. There you go. You should be my best friend now. I fed you like five times, dog. Come on. Was there a cat food that I haven't seen? If there is, I don't think I've seen it. Adit, I'm on my way to fix your uh, thing very quickly here. Just give me a minute. What is our market price for the day? 130. So if I go fishing today, I can sell for some good profits. Neat. Yeah, we gotta talk to the mayor. Not the. Uh... I'm, th I'm trying to. I'm trying to think. We don't see the dude at the com or the builders commerce guild or whatever. We don't see him as much as I a thought I would. Rat? <laughs> That's a grand tale. But but then again, uh, there are strange tales about the monsters from the periphery. So I'm not surprised. But the good news is that the goo's all gone. So thank you for your work. Let me give you some compensation. Thousand gold, uh, reputation with him, and then uh, some builder points. Neat. I'll take it. You don't need anything else from me there, do you, sir? It's unsettling how much we don't know about our surroundings. I hope with the Rat King's defeat, the Bandy Rats won't bother us again for a long while. We can hope. We can hope. I'm assuming now that we've done that, they'll be able to do the next like little story beat. Or we might have to actually finish the uh, the wood tree thing before that happens. Who knows? Uh, but anyways, let's go see if we can make the... the cooking set and then some other stuff. Nora, I'm gonna leave you to it over there. You're fine. There we go. Uh... Yeah, let's go ahead and turn some of this stuff in, because I have, yeah, way too much space there. All right, you guys get fucking expensive, 15,000. I'm assuming this is going to be like 20, I'm assuming, but who knows. It's expensive. All right, uh, cooking set. What do we got? I wonder if these show up in the order that you get them, or if they have like specific spots. Probably just the order you get them. Stone brick, I have more than that. Uh, iron pan, I got that, and marble planks. Too easy. All right. Uh, do I have this stuff on me? Does not look like it. I keep forgetting I put this here to make my life easier because I just forget it freaking exists. All right, uh, real fast though, let's put you right over there. You can go in there. There we go. You guys are all happy now. All right, uh, we need... Where are we? We have a lot of topazes, and I don't think we're using them for a whole lot. Uh, let's see. You know what? While we're here, is there anything else I can drop off? Probably. I don't know if we're gonna do these valves. Yeah, let's go ahead and put those away for now. Actually, that's not the right spot for the valves, is it? But we can put you away. I'll put the pigments away in here, too. It doesn't really make a huge deal, but it'll work, I guess. Um... I don't think we need the loudspeaker, so we'll put that away. Uh, we can sell you. We can put you away. I don't care about you. Um, 
Alright, uh, stuff we need. We need you, and then we need wherever our bricks are, and there's our bucket, and valve you can go into loot. There we go. So we got an iron pan, we got some marble planks, and we got some stone bricks. Neat. That was quick. Let's put you over with the other cooking type stuff over here. Uh, right about... Yeah, I don't want it to be in the corner. Uh, yeah, like right over here should be fine then. Hold the ingredients you want to put. Hold the ingredient that you want to put into the cooking set. Stand before the cooking set and press the attack button to add. Add the correct ingredients within the time limit. More ingredients doesn't make it better. The key is to find the best match. Every time you'll discover a new dish or recipe, they will be recorded in the cooking recipe. After cooking is finished, continue to interact with the cooking set to retrieve the food. That seems like a more work than it's necessary. Wait. Okay, we do have some recipes. Rice, bamboo, papaya, and golden salmon. And then meat, salt, and snake berry. Now, what does he say is actually part of the recipe? Uh, fish, eggs, and salt. Okay, so we gotta find the, the fish. I don't know if I actually have any fish right now. Uh, we need quality leather. Let's get that made. We need another pigment, okay. I think we can make a pigment though, so let's do that real fast. Hardened clay, sweet. Uh, let's see, pigment. We need rainbow flower. I think we're just gonna have to go buy the pigment. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Where's uh, your nemesis, the cat? I haven't seen him or other. There she is. I don't have any fish for you today, cat, but eventually. Eventually. Alright, uh, lady, I need some pigmentations here, please, and thank you. Uh, you know what, let's just buy, like, ten just to have them. Because if I need that quality leather for anything else, it's not a bad idea to have more of the pigments on hand. Yeah, let's go turn in the tree farm stuff. And not sure what that's gonna do, but it might do something. Who knows? Maybe they'll have like a new variety of tree over there. That'd be pretty cool. And apparently we gotta go past the tree farm, it looks like. Hmm. It looks like we might have to go uh yeah, like further out or something. I think we fought the, I think we fought the uh, bigger evil bunny, so I'm gonna leave them alone. I'm not gonna bother them today. I think the crabs are like one of the only things that we haven't fought the, the bigger version of. Oh, I see a treasure chest over there. I really do. I don't know if I can get to it anytime soon, but I do see the treasure chest. Right, got the water engine and the water wheel, which is pretty freaking huge. Okay. Uh, do I start you, or... Oh, that's why this whole thing was here. It's just for that. Okay. I got you. Whoa, uh... Irrigation system. Uh... I hope I have... Well, I hope I have enough, because they only told me they wanted the one, right? Water storage? Oh, I need four sprinklers. Um... I have the water storage. Do I have the sprinklers? I don't know if I have the sprinklers. I don't think the sprinklers are made in here, are they? I don't think they are. Uh, so I gotta figure out how to make the... Uh... I gotta go figure out how to make the sprinklers. Hmm. Where do I put the water storage? That's my question.
Okay. I'll take some random animal bones near the bunnies, because, uh, why not? Okay. Now, let me see if I can put the... I need to see if I can put the uh, storage somewhere, or if I gotta come back with the sprinklers as well. Dang it, I thought we had everything. I don't remember them saying anything about sprinklers, but maybe I was just not paying attention, which is incredibly likely. All water storage. Okay, good. So there's the water storage. Now we just gotta find all the sprinkler type stuff. Oh, is that where this goes? This goes kind of like to the watery area or weapons research, I guess. Sure, why not? Sprinklers might be something to make at the work table, actually. Uh, let's see if I talk to you guys. Do you guys say anything? Hello. Arlo was very high on you when he told me about your adventure fighting the Rat King. He said he never expected a builder to be able to put up a fight, much less win. Must have been a fright. It wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad at all. Do you have anything? No. Okay, still don't know what you do, but you're there. Uh, let's see. Where is our bus station? I want to actually get stuff done today. Uh, no, I don't want I want to go back over here. Sprinklers. What do we need to make the sprinklers? Because I have no idea. Uh, let's see. Small satchel. We need more quality leather. That's fine. Sprinkler. Ah, there we go. Uh, we need more copper pipes. Of course we need more copper pipes. We always need more copper pipes. I should have been making copper pipes. Uh, bucket. Um... I think I said three per, so we need 12, and we have four or three, so we need like nine more. Uh, just make 12, I guess. And it'll be done in 12 hours. So by the end of the day. Fantastic. How are you doing over here? We need more uh, quality leather. Ah, you're not going to be done till the end of the day. This pouch is turning out to be less than ideal. I'm not trying to chop it up, you bastard. Go away. Alright, so our goal now is just some resource gathering, I guess. Uh, let's see. I don't think you guys are going to give me too much in the way of... Uh, whatchamacallit? Precious stones, but if you do, great. Yeah, let's do some uh, resource gathering and then we'll head off for fishing. Probably... I don't know. Yeah, probably probably the one with the, uh, the wise fish, because those give a pretty decent... Uh, a bit of money, even if they're not over market price for the day. Come on, I need more bloodstones here, life. I'm getting plenty of copper and marble and stuff, but very little in the way of the bloody stones of goodness. It's nice that the rocks do seem to respawn. That does make life a little easier here. I think we're mostly okay on the, the wood situation for now. So we probably don't need to worry about it too much. We might be able to finish the sprinkler situation by the end of the night if we get all of our copper uh, copper pipes and I remember to come back for them. Can I chop you down or no? I don't think I can, or if I can, I don't have the materials for it now, that's for sure. You know, for big-ass rocks, that thing went down quick. I'm okay with that. 
very okay with that. How many blood ores have we got? Five. That's not a lot. Blood ores, blood rubies, whatever they're called. I don't know. Not paying too much attention. But it seems like the seems like those are reasonably rare, and that's going to be a limiting factor in making more of those uh, super furnaces or industrial furnaces or whatever you call them. I don't freaking know. The, the big guys, you know, the things that I like. All right, uh, let's go ahead and hmm. yeah, let's go ahead and eat real fast. It's not it's not going to be a massive difference, but this way we won't have to worry about uh, stopping in the middle of it. We can just fish for a while, get a nice little chunk of change, and then probably be finished by the end of the night and good to go. And I got plenty of caterpillars. Sweet. Uh, so, or, Sonia, you ran into me, so don't uh, tell me that I'm in the way. Thanks. Appreciate it. Uh, let's see. Porsche Hot Pot usually gives pretty good. Uh, stew gives a little more. That's fine. We pay any more, we'll get like 100, but we'll pay like. 60 more or something, so might as well just get the basic amounts here. Good enough for me. And let's go fishing. Maybe chop down some trees on the way back or something. Yeah, I don't think uh, whoever ordered the satchel is getting it right away, sadly. Oh well. That sounds like a then problem. Let's see how much of a difference this makes in catching the wise fish. Probably a, yeah, probably a sizable amount. It made catching the Goliath a lot easier, that's for sure. At least it seemed like it did. Good thing I didn't hit the water there. That would have been rather unfortunate for everybody involved. All right, let's try not to fish up too many pieces of junk today. That'd be great. Oh, catfish, you don't stand a chance. Like, you didn't stand a chance with the basic bitch rod. With the, the big pimpin' rod, you really don't stand a chance. Oh, that guy went by. That guy went down much faster, too. Nice. Yeah, it looks like this everything's just gonna fill up the stress bubble fat or slower. This guy seems like he might still cause a little bit of problems, but if he hadn't dashed out of the way there, we probably would have got him on the first try right there, so that would have been nice. Yeah, it just seems like the uh, stress bubble is filling up a lot slower here, which is quite bueno. Oh yeah, we don't even have to... We don't even have to go for uh, two bubbles there. The Emperor Wisefish, a little more pain in the ass, but not by much. I'm okay with this. And if we stop at around 20 hundred or so in game time, that should give us enough time to get to the, uh, the place to sell it and be good to go. Because I don't want to come back tomorrow and find the market price plummeted to like fucking 80% or something. Okay, that guy, the little blade fish took four minutes. You took... Two minutes. Oh, the, the the wise fish took like the least amount of time somehow. What about the catfish? Five minutes. Uh, I wonder if that's consistent. Well, that took four minutes. I guess it was just kind of random, just just in general, I guess. Yeah, it took three minutes right there. Yeah, it's just random, I guess. Which which one you get, I guess. Come here, you little bastard. Not wise enough to get away from me. Uh, feel free to have. Ah, can't damn it. Uh, feel free to have like a uh, a uh, king variety in here. 
That'd be great. I wonder how they determine if there is going to be a king variety in your fishing pool for the day. If it's just like a random chance, or maybe it's like uh, if you catch a certain amount of one, then you'll probably have a higher chance of catching a kingfish or something. I don't know. I really don't. I think we'll save the catfish, try to make that a uh, fish stew for Dawa. I'm not getting the racket today. Thank you. Now, we still got a little bit of time here. We're good to go. Too many catfish, not enough wise fish, but eh, we still got in a couple of wise fish at least, so it's better than nothing. And the blade fish are acceptable, I guess. I mean, the base blade fish is basically the same price as an emperor catfish, and by basically, I mean exactly. If it wasn't for the catfish over here, if it was just blade fish and the wise fish, that'd be perfect. Ooh, you are an emperor. There you go, bastard. Nice. Alright, give me that. Actually, I don't, I don't think it matters if it's a king wise fish or not. They'll still give the same amount for whatever reason. All the, all the kings give 5,000, looks like. Unless unless there's like a super king somewhere that gives more, but somehow I doubt it. And we still got plenty of time. I want to check on our stamina real fast, actually. Okay, we're good on stamina. Neat. Oh, yeah. Too easy. Yeah, I like this new fishing rod. It doesn't seem like it's much of an upgrade based on, like, the... Like, I was thinking maybe, like, the... The stress bubble might have got it bigger or something. And if it did, it's a really small bigger, but it definitely makes it so the stress fills up uh, slower and just makes it easier to catch it in general, which is very nice. As you can see by Mr. Catfish, who didn't stand a uh, snowball's chance in hell. Granted, he never does, but, you know. Still, that's the point of the matter. Ooh, that's a king right there. Yeah. Pretty sure it said, uh, it had a crown on it. I ain't gonna be careful. The more careful you are, the easier it is to catch. Yeah, boy. Blade Fish King. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Ah, uh, if you get a if you get a king every day, that's a very solid source of income. If you get two, ooh, you are beautiful, and you will bankrupt that poor little restaurant in a matter of minutes. All right, another hour's worth of fishing. Let me get back and turn it all in. Another emperor, neat. Correct. I love it. Give me another, uh, give me a king wise fish, that'd be great. Or a regular wise fish, that works too, I guess. Yeah, if it wasn't for the stupid getting lost in the, uh, the sewer last time, we would have made maybe a little bit of progress. Probably would have had time to do too much fishing, but still would have got something done besides just getting lost in there. That was a bastard move, putting the entrance that opened up from the lever on top of the area that I couldn't see until I was like a few distance a few feet away. That's basically what happened. Is it opened up and I didn't see it until 
I stepped back and looked at it pretty much. Alright, about three or four more casts and then we give up. You appear to be of the Emperor Ray. Not that it makes a huge difference, but, you know, it works. Go a little further, because I th think we'll be able to run up to the uh, bus station and take it back over there if we go at like 8.30 or something. I think it said it closes at 10 o'clock. I could be mistaken. I might have said 11, I don't remember. Yeah, let's go to 8.30 here, and then we'll give up, and be good to go. Okay, we're out of stamina. That's actually perfect. Perfect. What is our haul? Uh, let's see, we need to put you... Okay, so we got 16 bladefish, 4 salmon, 22 catfish, plenty of wise fish, a couple emperors, not a whole lot of emperors, but a couple, uh, and then the one king bladefish. Nice. Good stuff. And then... Honestly, it might be faster just to run for the bus station that's over this way. Yeah, honestly, we can just run over there pretty fast. It's not going to be a huge deal. Okay, that's fine. That works for me. If my stamina recovers. And they'll probably eat a, eat some of our snacks, uh, get some more stamina back, and then go for yeah, maybe a little more mining or fish or. Yeah, I think we're done fishing for now. Uh, yeah, a little more mining or treeing or logging or whatever you want to call it, just so I can have enough of that stuff. Uh, I was hoping it would tell me the uh, the time it closes here, but it does not seem to. That's a shame. All right, 16 of you guys is 1,200. Nice. Four of you, 150. Catfish, if I sold all of you guys, 800, so not a whole lot. Wise fish, 5,000. Nice. Emperor catfish, goodbye. You guys, 3,000, and then... Ah, you guys are out of money. Damn it. I did not realize I was selling all that. Uh, if I buy you guys all back, would that give me my actual... I don't know if that gives me my actual price back or not. Um... I think, I th okay, I think it is, I think it is giving me my actual price back. So, yeah, because 30% of 60, 612, 18. Yeah, so I could buy these back and get my... Get that back and then sell you for... Still not enough. Okay, you still don't have enough to actually buy it. That's a shame. All right, so sell you guys again. That's fine. I need to find someone with a 6,000 gold to buy my... Uh, other fish, or just sell them later or something. Probably just gonna end up selling them later. All right, so let's go ahead with one of you and one of you. That gives me enough to chop down a couple things. Let's go check in on everything real fast, see how we're doing. Tawa, how you doing, champ? Or your Kiwa. You guys all look the same. I'm sorry, but you do. It's just the way it is. Uh, let's see, it said... Fish, eggs, and salt. I think I have those. Just want to make sure. You need two more of these. Uh, let's see. Sprinklers. How are we doing on those? We need four of these, right? Is it four? Or how many do we need? Okay, we do need four. Okay, so we're good on that. 
Neat. So we can go turn that in real fast, actually. Fantastic. That's what I like to see. Uh, I'll worry about you guys on our way back. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead and turn that in right now and see if we get anything out of it. Besides the satisfaction and only the tree farm is surviving. Let's go clockwise, I guess. I don't think they're up and out, so the, the uh, whatever their names are, uh, Edith and the other guy, I don't know if they're up and out, so even if we do finish this, I don't know if they'll say anything about it, but uh, we'll try. This is a pretty decent sized area. What are you? No idea what you are, but you're big and fluffy. All right, sprinkler two, uh, and then we got you, and then the other one. Maybe not be quite as clockwise as I was thinking, but it's close enough. Damn it! Seems like a weird spread for the sprinklers, but hey, if it works, it works, I guess. Uh, while we're here, let's chop something down just to. It's not letting me chop it down. I don't know why. Oh, it's I think it's because the trees are sick, aren't they? Yeah, like the trees are all messed up right now. That's right. Never mind. I forgot. That's the whole point of the whole sprinkler thing we're doing here. I can't deforest it until it is good to go. That's a shame. Wait, here, you guys don't need these rocks getting in the way of the roots of the trees. So, yeah, let's take care of these for you. There you go. Sprinkler, where are you at? Way in the middle over here somewhere. I don't know how I missed this, but I did. So, oops. Ah, there we go. Much better. How do we get over there? Thank you for everything. Here's your commission fee. Now that we're back in business, if you ever need any wood supplies, you can check the box besides our home. We can afford some every day. Ooh, that sounds neat. Uh, nice. 1,500 gold, some rep points. So, wood resource store. What does this do? It's currently closed. Okay, so what do you guys do with the, uh... And we're back in business. Thank you for all your help. You're welcome, but what do you, what do I do with the the uh, the tree storage thing? So maybe they maybe they deliver wood to you or something like that, but I can't seem to do anything with it right now. But I can probably chop down a tree. Uh, it might not let me chop down a tree until like tomorrow or something when it's I had a chance to be refreshed or something like that. Oh well, I tried. I can only do so much if the game lets me. rocks over here we can grab. Uh, there's a lot of trees and stuff over here to grab, obviously, but I want more rocks because we kind of need those. But at the very least, let's just go ahead and get some uh, some tree-type stuff out of the way here. But yeah, if that turns out that they just, like, deliver, like, wood to you or something, that'd be great. I'm assuming you'd have to pay for it. It's not going to be free, but I don't mind paying to get a get some wood every day. I definitely save save on chopping down all this stuff, that's for sure. Oh, you're kickable. Uh, I think we might get some apples out of you, and if we get any apples out of you, we can make some stuff back at the uh, farm of the 
fried apple variety. Speaking of which, I want my apples to grow in, but they're not gonna grow in anytime soon. And there goes our stamina for the night. So you know what? That's probably gonna do it. We'll go check on everything, see if we can make that, uh, uh, see if we can make our commission, turn it in tomorrow morning, and then be good to go. If we got stamina back from that, we didn't get a lot. I oh, need one more. Okay, so that's going to be done around 2.30 or so. Okay. Uh, we need to collect and refuel. Man, you guys, you guys need to be refueled like constantly. It's ridiculous. I might eventually take these little guys out and just try to put in more of these uh, bigger ones just because they're just more efficient in general. I don't have to come back and restock them every 10 hours or whatever it is. Okay, stop trying to chop it off. I think, yeah, I think, uh, like on the first on the first day we put that down or something, I was, I was looking at it and actually did say, it actually did say, hey, uh, you can use your axe to chop this stuff, uh, uh, pick up some of this stuff if you don't, like, want to pick it up manually or whatever. But I didn't notice it until I was looking back at it, but I'm not trying to chop it down right now, that's for sure. So... Oh well. Right, let's see. Carbon steel. Let's go. Alright, we're at 20, 28 right now, so that's not too bad of a supply right there. Uh, what are you working on? Um, carbon steel. I think you need to be working on uh, charcoal. Yeah, let's do that. We are running low on wood. So if, the, if we have, we really do get the opportunity to get more um, wood from like the tree farm thing. That'd be real nice actually. Because we do go through wood reason, reasonably fast here. Alright, copper bars. We need more of you apparently because why not? More carbon steel. Let's go. Build bricks. I think we're reasonably good on these, but I just want to make sure to have a decent supply of everything at this point, because it's not a bad idea. Tin alloys, we are currently sitting on 29. Okay, we're doing good on a lot of stuff, actually. Still, good idea to keep going. And then, manganese still bar. You guys are very slowly coming along, but it's coming along. That's good enough for me. Awesome. Alright, uh, let's see. More pipes. There's our leather. We can make this thing right here. Small satchel. Uh, who needs that, actually? I might be able to turn it in, but probably not. Uh, ooh. Sam. Uh, I think the... I think the, uh... bus station stops running, like, right now, actually. But I might be able to get to her. Uh, she might go to. She's probably gonna go to sleep. That's the problem. Like right as we get to her, she'll go to sleep. We might make it. We might not. Either way, we will probably pass out on the way back home. Let's see. You are still awake. Let's go. Sam, where you at? I need to talk to you. She's apparently at home or something like that. Petra. Um, oh, there's a treasure chest back here. Neat. What's done? That's actually rather useful. Uh, Sam, she closed at 9 o'clock. Damn it, that was so close too. All right, uh, we might have enough chance. We, we might have enough time to make some, make another furnace, but we might need to actually just put on some more stuff onto the the grinder or whatever it is to make like more steel plates or whatever it is we're gonna need, probably. And yeah, tomorrow we need to figure out the uh, the wood uh, the tree farm situation 
and then also the just the wood in general situation. Ah, uh, you could probably make another one of you. We have some grinding saws. We have, we have all that stuff, but let me see what we need for our industrial furnace. We need marble planks, steel plates, and industrial cores. We have all of those. Let's go. We have all of those on hand. Uh, let's put you over there, and you over there, and over there. Now question, hang on. Do I have enough for... I have ten. I need five more anyways. Okay, so we're gonna set something to making these uh, steel plates here. But at the very least, we can make this now. We can get this started. Let's go. We'll put you right over... there. Let's go ahead and get you going, and if I tell you to go four days, nine hours for 50 copper bars, uh, three and a half day or three days for 50 copper bars, charcoal, a little over a day for 50 charcoal, that's not too bad, lead, a day for six lead, uh, okay, so a lot of this stuff will be made pretty quick. Um, apartment steel bars probably isn't the worst idea, but we do need a bit more charcoal, so let's do this. Uh, let's For the first day, you'll make a ton of charcoal, and after that we'll put you over onto the... Oh wow, we are out of wood. After that we'll put you onto the... Uh, the steel bars there. Alright. Yeah, we need a couple of you, so let's get going on that. Awesome. Um, you. Let's make a few bronze pipes. That'll be... That'll use 50 bronze bars, but it'll be nice to just have a bunch ready. Let's see for you. Uh... I think we're good on a lot of this stuff, uh, but more marble planks are always good. If I do that, that's 30 bronze bars for 10 more plates, or we can do a couple copper plates. Yeah, let's do some more hardwood. There we go. That works. Uh, let's see you. Oh, we'll just hold off on having you do anything right now. Let's just make sure you're stocked up with stuff. Uh, you are stocked up. Good stuff. Uh, you can go and make... Let's see, what else do we need here? Uh, we can make delicate fur, and then we can make more of the other stuff. Uh, waterproof cloth. We might need this for something eventually. I don't know what, but... Uh, that takes four fiber cloths to make. That's kind of weird, but okay. I'll make that just to have it. There we go. Awesome. We're doing good. We're doing good. Uh, I need to see if, I need to see about the uh, salt and the uh, fish thing here, if I have them. Um... Okay, uh, salt. I know I have eggs in there somewhere, I'm just not sure where. Uh, salt. Uh... Emily gives me, okay, I was about to say, Emily gives me eggs, like, all the time, so I'm Pretty sure I had some. I'm just not sure where to put it. Alright, so let's see here. For you, let's go ahead and put... That. That. And... That. Alright, so add you. Add you. And add you. And you guys will take just long enough for me to pass out, so we're not going to find out till the morning. Oh well, if it's there when I wake up, great. If not, we'll try again later. But either way, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one.